The South Korean economy has been recovering strongly overall, but in July, data show industrial output and consumption were both down as the fourth wave of the pandemic took hold. But government statisticians say the decline was not as bad as might have been expected. Om ji -young has more. South Korea's industrial output and consumption both dropped in July for the first time in two months. According to data released by Statistics Korea on Tuesday, the nation's overall industrial production index stood at 112.1 last month, down 0.5 percent compared to June. It's a reversal from June's 1.6 percent growth. The overall drop in production was led by fall in the output of face-to-face -face services, including restaurants and accommodation, which fell by around 5 percent, and sports and leisure activities, which dropped by 5.5 percent. The car industry also saw production slump by around 4 percent. On the other hand, the mining and manufacturing sectors saw output rise by 0.4 percent, led by an increase in system semiconductor production. The service sector also edged up 0.2 percent, mainly driven by the wholesale and retail sector and the IT sector. Despite the growing uncertainties amid the fourth wave of the pandemic, mining, manufacturing and service industries have shown an increase in output and retail sales have fallen by a relatively small amount. We believe that the economy has shown better than expected results. Consumption in July also fell by about 0.6 percent amid the social distancing measures, with clothing and cars seeing large drops. Spending by the public administration sector decreased by 8.3 percent on month, which was the largest decrease in about eight years. This was due to lower spending on vaccine purchases in July. Finance Minister Hong Namgi said on his social media that while the impact of the fourth wave was inevitable, the decrease has been smaller than previous waves of the pandemic. Om Ji-yong, Arirang News.